Hey, this is Tim bringing you words of grace today from East Harlem, actually. Uh, beautiful East Harlem. And, and I'm surveying one section of North Central Park that's called the Butterfly Gardens. And I wanted to bring you here for a, a quick uh, motivational message. Uh, the, the message is don't quit. Uh, persevere. Keep going. Uh, my verse, I want to kind of plug into your head, is uh, be patient in well-doing. For in due season you will reap if you faint not. All right, so those are words of grace today. So faint not today, okay? Persevere, be patient. I wanted to bring you here because uh, I think one little uh, creature illustrates this better than, than any other. I was just thinking of the beautiful butterfly. It's so delicate and fragile, this monarch butterfly. Beautiful, but so fragile that, that very easily can be uh, hurt and broken. Weighs less than a gram, right? A paper clip. And yet this uh, beautiful butterfly flies 2,500 miles, 3,000 miles uh, to, uh, to Mexico, uh, to the south where it can escape the, the winter here. Uh, what an amazing feat for such a small butterfly. And it doesn't go fast necessarily. Uh, I'm sure it finds a lot of problems along the way, but it keeps going. It keeps moving. It keeps flying. And it gets there. One way trip over 2,000 miles to 3,000 miles these little butterflies will go. They do this because it's what God has called them to do. Right? It's what God made these butterflies to do. So the question is not how powerful, how strong um, something is. The question is, does it quit? Or does it keep moving? And so the question for you too, is not how powerful or strong are the things in your path, but the, the question is this, not am I strong enough? Is this too hard? Uh, is, is everyone going against me with this? Uh, the question is, is this what God wants me to do? Uh, if this is what God wants you to do and you're sure of that, that this is God's direction, then continue to pursue it without quitting. Um, like if I were to decide today that I needed to, to uh, start a career as an NBA basketball player, you should probably tell me, Tim, uh, quit that dream. Uh, that's just not God's desire for me. Uh, but if there's something that you know God has called you to, stick to it. Persist. Uh, be patient in well-doing, for in due season you will reap if you faint not.